And on today's New York shit. So yesterday I reported on the 6 9 situation where he allegedly, well not allegedly, you can prove it now, with the aftermath of 6 9 getting his ass whooped in the LA Fitness in Florida, Miami to be exact. And I didn't really come here for some updates because I'm pretty sure everybody's gonna be reporting on this situation. So you're gonna find out what happened. But what I came here to say was, you know what I found interesting? No, it wasn't him finally getting caught lacking. No, it wasn't the fact that the response of the video was mildly, but overwhelmingly the opposite of what I thought it would be in which people randomly started taking the side of oh I feel so sorry for him oh he didn't deserve all that you know what's actually standing out to me the fact that, that I didn't catch that this guy had on poom poom shorts bro I thought they stripped him out of his pants but allegedly that was his outfit wow New York shitty man wow but they got other people in the same exact spirit as 6 9 you don't believe me let's take a look over to Brownsville damn her shit fat bro not even fat her shit fat oh but don't worry it gets better I wonder what she got on her feet Nigga, probably what some stilettos probably got them white toenails and shit Woo, French tip toenail. Let's see it. What the fuck? Girl, them ain't French tips. Them is French fries. Them is you need to tip them French niggas to fix those. It's why the ashes, them shits look, man, that's like the tip of an iceberg. You look like you tippy toed all the way here from Houston, shorty. But in conclusion, yo, Brownsville, why y'all doing this? Y'all don't see the Bronx is leading the way for dirtiest borough as they should. Why y'all trying to bring the crowd back to Brooklyn, Brownsville? Come on.